From a moral standpoint, uh, there's a lot of questions about mink as to whether we should raise them just for their pelts and not for the rest of them. Uh, often criticized that unless you're going to eat something, it's not farming. But we have tree farming in Nova Scotia. Uh, we've got lots of types of farming that do not involve eating. But uh, in this issue, there's a market out there for the product and basically we're fulfilling the market, doing it in a very humane way and doing it in a way that doesn't do any harm. We're saving a lot out of the landfill sites in this, so it's an environmentally sound way of raising them that we can take 30 to 40 percent of the food that we give these mink, our waste products that would normally go to a landfill, and now the products are coming out. We harvest the uh, pelt off them, and then the rest of the products are used for biofuel, for composting, uh, making electricity now in Nova Scotia, not going back to landfill sites. Uh, the manure is fantastic for our agricultural land. I'm in the Annapolis Valley, a uh, very heavily agricultural area. We have a shortage of livestock in Annapolis Valley. Far too much cropland, we need the manure. The agricultural commodity of mink is just a fantastic balance within the industry.